How are you doing, ladies and gentlemen? Welcome to this long-term Ping Pioneer cart bag review. And this is just a continuation of my prior video you can see on my channel. Uh, I did that when I got the bag, but now that I've had it for just over two seasons, I'm going to do a review over it for the long term. So let's check it out. So we've got a We've got a 15 divider which with one dedicated putter well. The dividers don't go all the way down to the bottom, which I think is a negative of this bag, but it still does have single dividers. They go about probably 80% down. They do get a little bit tangled at the bottom every once in a while, but it's not that bad. Got some good handles here. For carrying I use those quite a bit now let's go over the pockets so this first pocket up top it's a velour line pocket for valuables I usually use that for like my wallet put some money in there my coins and I also have a magnetic pocket this I usually store my rangefinder balls and miscellaneous stuff but you can see the black has faded from all the Sun and you can see the magnet coming out right here and it's starting to right there so hopefully that doesn't become a real issue later on and then you could also see the difference in color after being in the sun quite a bit this is what it looked like brand new and this is what it looks like now so we got on this side we got a really big pocket One thing that I do not like about this pocket is this umbrella. This is where the umbrella passes through and it goes through the top right through there. I don't really like that. I don't ever use it to be honest. Then you got a just a random side pocket there. These are pretty deep so I I can hold my hoodies or cold gear. Um holds quite a Quite a bit of stuff in there, good sized pockets. Then we got another little pocket on the bottom. It looks like I got my, my rules book. No cheating, fellas and ladies. So th those are some good pockets. Oh, I also forgot about these towel rings. We got one on each side. Like that because I put my dirty towel on one and a clean towel on the other. Let's see, let's go down to this pocket. I use this for my balls and tees. It goes pretty deep down in there. I've got quite a bit of tees and I probably have at least a dozen balls in there right now. Maybe 10. I'll zip that up. Then we'll go to the cooler pocket. This is a great pocket. It keeps the the drinks cold I saw somebody ask how many cans it could fit definitely can fit a six pack up to I would say possibly a 12 but you're gonna lose space with this pocket because this pocket you're gonna lose space with this pocket because this pocket goes down into here and you'll also lose space on this pocket the more that you fill up that cooler pocket and this pocket I just put, keep my rain hood in there so it comes with the rain hood I just keep my rain hood in there. Cool thing about these bags is this front panel can come off. The zipper comes all the way off. So um, my mother owns an embroidery business and I'll mention that. It is Mihas Creations. I'll put a link in the description for it if anybody needs any embroidery needs. My mother can hook you up. And then, uh, oh, don't forget, on the bottom, it has a drain from the cooler pocket. So you can put ice in there and it will drain out, which is a bonus. Then it's got these little elastic pockets. I keep my, my dog's poop bags in there because I can take my dog to the course every once in a while. He actually loves it. Here he is, right here, to be honest. There he is. Say hi, Yoshi. Say hi. He loves the course. He loves it. 
You'll probably see him on one of my first videos, my 4th of July vlog special. You'll see him make an appearance. So on this side, you've got a cart strap pass-through. So you can put your cart strap through here and then go under through here. Comes out this side and then go back under on this side. I use that all the time because I golf with a push cart most of the time. And I'll show you that in a different video, but I'll just show you the wear and tear that it's actually caused. You can see a little hole from the rubbing of the cart strap. Um, it's not too too big of a problem, but I can only see it getting bigger over time. And it's not really on this side, so that's good. Let's go back to this side. So in this pocket, one of my favorite features is this, the key clips. I always put my keys on there. Never ever lose my keys when I put that on there. One of the best features of this bag. Then we've got another valuable scorecard and we've got another valuable lower line pocket, waterproof, supposedly. I don't think it worked very well because I played a tournament um, last March in the, in the rain and the stuff that was in this pocket got a little damp, so I don't think it's 100% waterproof, but water resistant, I guess. And then you got another little pocket here. Keep my my driver and my three wood tool in there if, if I ever need any adjustments. And then that deep pocket for the side. So that is the extended Ping Pioneer cart bag review. After two years, I can tell you that I really enjoy this bag. It's lasted and held up pretty well, other than those things that you saw. But I would definitely recommend this bag to anyone. And a good thing about this bag... Oh, and it comes with one strap for carrying, and then the, the handle. You can see the wear and tear from the push cart. And the carts that I put it on but other than that this this bag is done pretty well oh can't forget velcro for the glove you got a marker pocket and then a little pencil pocket can't forget to mention that on the inside I don't know if you can see it I'm gonna try to get you to see it but there's a zipper on the inside so if you ever drop anything down inside your bag, you've got a zipper that you can go inside and get it. You can actually see a little bit of the dividers. And what is this? Oh, look at that. I See? See how it works? You drop something down there and you find something. There you go. So that is my two-year review of the Ping Pioneer cart bag. I would definitely recommend it to anyone. It's a great bag. It has stood up well. And I will continue to use it until it falls apart. Thanks for watching. Please like, comment, subscribe to Golf with Hustine. Golf with Hustine on Instagram as well. Thank you for watching.